This is my review of the Barricade Roof Rack fitting your four-door 2007 and up JK. JKs have notoriously small interiors and there isn't a lot of cargo space. So if you're somebody who wants to be able to haul more gear, a roof rack like this might be a nice option. This roof rack isn't going to be nearly expensive as some of the top roof racks on the market. However, it's also going to be a little less sleek looking and you won't be able to get quite as many accessories that bolt right onto it. If you're looking for one of those other racks, we do have Gobi and a few other brands on the site. But if you're looking for one of the less expensive racks that'll still get the job done, this is a good one to take a look at. This rack is built from two inch round tubing that is 0.12 inch wall thickness. So you're going to have enough strength to carry up to 350 pounds up on the rack. The whole thing is covered in a textured black powder coat finish, which will match a lot of other off-road accessories and also your factory black plastic accents on your Jeep. The rack will mount to the windshield hinges in the front and either to the frame or to the body in the rear, so there isn't any drilling necessary. If you have an aftermarket bumper, I would recommend using the frame mounts. If you have a factory bumper that you're not willing to chop up, you will have to use the body mounts, which do require some drilling into the body. Once you have the rack installed, you'll be able to raise and lower your soft top by just removing the crossbars of the rack. However, you will not be able to install and uninstall your hard top with the rack in place. Speaking of those removable crossbars, those are attached with large plastic thumb screws, which make it very easy to remove and reinstall the crossbars. However, sometimes those thumb screws like to strip out. So a lot of people have been replacing them with a stainless steel wing nut setup, which is going to be a lot stronger and hold up a lot better, but still not require the use of any tools to get the crossbars on and off. This roof rack installs onto your Jeep really easily. It's designed to be a bolt-on installation unless you have a factory rear bumper that you're not willing to cut up. In that case, you have to use the body mounts in the rear of the rack instead of the frame mounts, and they do require you to drill into the body. Those holes are going to be very visible if you were ever to remove the rack, so I definitely recommend using the frame mounts instead. If you have a factory rear bumper that you like, you can cut a hole in it or cut the ends off of it in order to use those frame mounts. And those of you with an aftermarket rear bumper won't have to worry about it. You'll be able to use those frame mounts and not drill the body without a problem. If you do end up using the body mounts, the installation becomes a little bit more difficult because of the drilling you have to do. To start this installation, you'll start at the front of the Jeep and remove the four bolts in the windshield hinge to allow you to mount these two plates up on the hinges. You'll start on one side, then put the crossbar across the front, which also has your light mount tabs on it, and finally move along to the other side of the windshield hinge. From there, you have the bars that move toward the back of the Jeep, and finally the bars that attach to the back of the Jeep down to the mounts. At the same time that you're installing those, you'll install the crossbar across the back center of the Jeep, and finally the mounts, whether you're using the body mounts or the frame mounts. After you have everything installed, you can go through and tighten down all the bolts. As far as tools go for this installation, you won't need any specialty tools. However, you will need a good set of Torx bits to remove the factory Torx bolts that are in your windshield hinge. As I mentioned before, this rack is toward the bottom of the price range as far as roof racks are concerned. And really the only reason for that is one, that this isn't as sleek and stylish looking as some of the more expensive racks, but also it doesn't have all of the bolt-on accessories available for some of the other more well-known racks on the market. For instance, the Gobi racks that we offer have everything from kayak and bike mounts to shovel and high lift jack mounts. You could certainly get all of those accessories bolted onto this roof rack, however they're going to require some modification and it's not going to be quite as simple. So if you're looking for an inexpensive rack, you like the way that this one looks and you don't need a lot of those bolt-on accessories, I would definitely recommend taking a look at this one. If you want a rack that's a little bit more sleek and stylish and has a lot more easy to add accessory mounts, then we certainly have those options as well for a little bit more money. So whether you have a two-door or four-door JK and you're looking for a little bit of additional cargo space, a roof rack is a really nice option. Assuming you don't have any height restrictions, this rack will hold 350 pounds of additional cargo, and as long as you like the look, this rack will save you a lot of money over those top brands on the market. 
So that's my review of the Barricade Roof Rack fitting all 2007 and up JKs that you can find right here at ExtremeTerrain.com.